Okay, the chair, the armchair especially, uh, tends to be the most difficult piece to pad wrap. Uh, once you master it, it's, it's a piece of cake. Uh, one rubber band and one pad can do it. And what you want to do is just line it up diagonally. Now on long distance moves, this would be the time where you put a box or a cushion or anything that would fit in here before you pad wrap it. On locals, if space is not an issue, there's no need to do all that. That just takes extra time. So what we're going to do is we're just going to show you how uh, on a local move how you would do it. Start with the top, fold the top in, take your corners, and you're going to want to kind of work the chair around so that make sure that this whole leg is covered and this arm is going to be covered. Have your rubber band ready to put on. Bring your other corner over. And if you, if you can see, I have an exposed arm. Okay, so if you see here, there's an exposed arm. All you're going to want to do is work it around in your pad so that when you bring the end up, it's going to cover that arm. So in this case, it's going to mean kind of sliding it over just a hair. And that should give us just enough to get up over this arm. And now our arm is covered. The inside doesn't have to be covered. The, your main concern is covering the outside. You may fill this area with a box in the load anyways. So all I'll do is kind of put a knee on the pad, hold it in. This is where, what, what happens is if you don't pad this up correctly, the legs start coming through the chairs and the pad gets all uh, pulled off. All you do here, it's the same as most other pieces. You just make a nice, nice fold and bring the bottom up. Again, to your knee. Now this piece has wheels on it, which is just fine. The other thing with pad wrapping these items uh, prior to loading is they hold the wheels in. Sometimes these wheels pop right out. When you're able to pad wrap it prior, uh, it keeps the wheels in. All you do here, wrap it around the leg one time, nice and tight. Now, there are chairs out there with very flimsy legs, and that's something you have to pay attention to. If they're real flimsy legs, you're not going to want to uh, put too much pressure on them where you'll snap the legs. In this case, we have a good solid chair. Uh, you're not going to damage it by putting a little bit of pressure on it. After you've banded the bottoms of the legs, you simply crisscross your rubber band. Keep it tight at all times. Bring your chair up go around the top. Now what you're going to do is, especially with an armchair, bring it nice and tight, grab you some extra band, crisscross in the back, Secure the back of the chair. Okay, now this pad is, is not going anywhere. The, the band part here holds the arms on, in place. This holds it in place. You can carry it like this. Uh, you can have a dolly load and flip it on top of the dolly load on a seat on the very top of the dolly load. That's the best way of doing it because. Uh, when you're tied up using your arms to carry chairs, you could have a dolly load and a chair on top of it. 